Thank you. So, hello everyone. I am Siddharth. Uh, in these past few months, I had this opportunity to work on a project uh, called Embed Chat. Uh, so, here I am presenting you uh, what is Embed Chat and my about my progress and everything related to it. Um, let's start. So, what do you mean by Embed Chat? Uh, if I have to like uh, summarize it in like one line, uh, it's uh, it's like a mini rocket chat which can be embedded into any web application, uh, any web application that's like possible. Uh, as you can see on the right side, uh, here is the code. Like it's only a, a React component, and with this few lines of code, you can like integrate a rocket chat. And directly into your web application. So this was my project, and uh, yeah, uh, this is like a sneak peek to the entire product. Uh, yeah. So about the problems that we are like tra targeting to solve. Uh, yeah. So like uh, we have for integration of RocketChat into any application right now, we have iframe. Uh, we have the iframe solution, which is good but uh, like not that efficient i would say because uh, from time to time we experience ui leaks and uh, like it's it becomes too heavy for any other user application to uh, like host the entire rocket chat and uh, like make the fetch requests so uh, we targeted to solve uh, all those problems by like introducing uh, integration of rocket chat into any web application uh, no more UI uh, iframe UI leaks. No more heavy fetch requests, and like it will provide you with a custom adapted solution, which is like uh, very customizable and lightweight to set up. Uh, plus, it's uh, plus you can like integrate uh, it within a few minutes, and you can uh, start uh, improving your uh, user engagement around your application uh, instantly. Also, uh, the thing was, it's uh, tightly coupled with the Rocket Chat uh, instance that you host, so it's it will like persist the entire chat that you like chat. So it's like uh, different from live chat and uh, other uh, options there. Uh, it will like store every single chat uh, that the users has like uh, chats about. Uh, like the motto that we went about was uh, embed chat will ensure organization uh, that they use their valuable time building their product and like leave rocket chat with the stress to provide them with a powerful chatting solution so let me start so yeah uh, hello everyone uh, again hello i'm siddharth uh, uh, i've been a contributor to rocket chat uh, and some of its projects and I've been here uh, since 11 months now and my mentor uh, who unfortunately is like not uh, present right now in this call is Rohan Lekwani uh, who has been uh, a mem like uh, a rocketeer for over two years now and previous g soccer and also ex software engineer at Goje. He is an amazing mentor. He has guided me through these few months and also like he gave, gave me he gives me this incredible ideas when i get stuck around uh, some parts so yeah so about the component uh, so in the entire uh, embed chat component com like is com comprises of three things uh, it uh, like uses rocket chat js sdk for real time chat functionality fuselage for the ui and the rocket chat api to make api calls uh, i have like documented every part of uh, embed chat in the wiki and uh, about the uh, about the uh, like use cases and action uh, let's see uh, embed chat in action so like you know, whether it's an online store or uh, uh, whether it be a classroom or virtual conference or games etc you can integrate uh, embed chat in any any application and can like uh, start to 
increase the user engagement by a lot. Uh, so th these were the like uh, functionalities like you can provide your uh, loyal customers some like hefty discounts in some uh, like big billion day sale or something else. Uh, increase engagement or also like uh, you can share documents and uh, important documents and everything that will be like persisted throughout the entire like entire uh, eternity i would say uh, if you don't delete delete the instance or like uh, uh, message but uh, here is the like some of the here are some of the functionalities of mbchat so this uh, entire thing is the component uh, and you can like start uh, messaging uh, in real time mode uh, and also uh, whatever you like chat in the embed chat is like directly maps to the rocket chat instance uh, that you had hosted so it's like tie, tie very tightly coupled with the uh, rc instance and for the uh, next part uh, yeah mm, uh, okay so uh, in the previous uh, this slide, uh, we can see that we opted for single sign on authentication, uh, Google single sign on authentication. Uh, the like um, reasoning behind that was uh, let's say uh, a user uh, comes to uh, tech.co site or any blog site and he doesn't want to get redirected or like go somewhere else to like join Rocket Chat, register, or like go through two to three step process and like start engaging in the app app itself so like uh, with that single click if the user is present in the instance uh, well enough we will like directly use the use that user for chat or, or if the user is not uh, present it will like create the user in the rc instance and uh, use it uh, for uh, use it for chat uh, so this meant no registration, no remembering of passwords and no redirects. So uh, that's the reason why we opted for Google Auth uh, single sign on Auth. Uh, and uh, like these are like some other features uh, that we integrated like pinning and starring of messages. So uh, like uh, if the user has the permission to like pin the message here, he or she can directly pin pin the message, and every user can star a message, and uh, it has a different UI for to show all the pin and star messages. And as we had like our uh, uh, Danish Mirza talking about how reactions are uh, like really useful and uh, really reflective of what the user's mood are, uh, we entered this emoji picker and uh, we can now like directly uh, react to messages uh, using embed chat and also uh, it it like it directly maps to the rc instance that uh, like you host the application on and uh, also with the counting part and all this ui uh, it's using uh, the Fuselage, comp fuselage for it and also uh, it's a react component so there were questions like uh, was it you know, uh, just for react uh, framework only so uh, i would say it's like uh, it's going both ways and you can use uh, the component directly by installing and like npm install uh, rocket embed chat and it will like install the entire embed chat into your application but uh, there were uh, there was another solution uh, for other frameworks like you can host the embed chat in some uh, domain and you can use it in any framework of your choice like uh, you can just um, put the source url and uh, use it uh, like instantly uh, yeah, so uh, some of the challenges that I faced while creating this app were um, Google SSO authentication uh, was a like a big challenge because uh, I had to create the Google pop-up and learn about uh, how the Google 
API works and about access token, ID token, and all of all of the stuff, and like integrate integrated with uh, Rocket Chat. So the previous slide which I had shown you like of Google single sign-on that was a high overview high level overview but uh, like we had to handle uh, so many uh, so many edge cases uh, like handling usernames while registering and uh, some others also like uh, yeah so we are now parsing the emojis in the text input itself uh, which I think uh, is an amazing thing because which gives amazing user experience uh, and let me like show you uh, what I'm talking about like if we do this and it gets parsed here so this uh, emoji will like directly um, uh, like it's like compared completely compatible with uh, rocket chats uh, emoji set so that was a challenge and um, yeah, so like also like i had to research a lot about the subscription model web sockets and uh, ddp drivers and also about the rocket chat chase sdk to integrate the real-time chat functionality uh, also uh, handling of different attachments uh, where like uh, an important task. Uh, also, we have uh, we have some progress around it uh, as of now, uh, but we still need to like integrate the uh, integrate sending of attachments from Ember Chat. Uh, yeah, so um, my learnings were I learned about how to create a Rocket ReactJS component library. Uh, learned about uh, if the Rocket Chat API and SDK emojis, Google API. And the slick thing I did is uh, there was this G API script, uh, which was like uh, like an old NPM package and uh, it was uh, broken from then. So what I did is like, I fixed the entire package and published it uh, under my name. So uh, also I had have given them credits, uh, no, no offense, but uh, that was great uh, and um, yeah uh, what's next uh, uh, threads are also an important uh, feature that we like that we are like planning to integrate so that uh, like uh, rocket uh, each rocket chat major feature will be like integrated within ember chat and uh, i think it will be uh, ready to be published so yeah this was me and also I wanted to share this link uh, to everyone so uh, we can chat here also if anyone likes. Uh, it is hosted uh, in an instance that they just forgive me but uh, that would be like pretty easy to uh, like log in and sign up uh, and get started. Uh, yeah, so this was my project. Yeah, yeah very good. Congratulations. Uh, and I like the idea that uh, you, you, so you found a package and it was broken, so you sent a PR. <laughs> <laughs> that's the, that's open source right there, right? <laughs> it's like, uh, you, you need to use something and it's not, it's broken. So, okay, let's fix that. <laughs> that's very awesome. Okay, so we have, uh, we have a, couple minutes for questions if yeah sure sure if anyone to have a question uh very good yeah that's the real open source energy summit that's very true uh and we are very happy that you you you, you learned a lot and uh, it was a very a great journey uh, journey it, uh, uh, it wouldn't have been like possible without you all like duda you especially and singhi sir uh, Debe, sir and all my friends out here uh, it was like a great journey which uh, like will be really memorable for my lifetime yeah congratulations a great job thanks a lot <laughs>